Holy Spirit, I just pray that you would place this prayer in front of whoever needs to see it in this moment. Father, have your way. Let your will be done. Heavenly Father, I want to pray over the person watching this prayer. I believe that you specifically placed this prayer in front of this person for a reason. You always show up right on time. So God, I pray that whatever burdens this person has, Lord God, that you would silence the enemy, silence the distractions, and lift the burdens off of them right now. Pray for your peace that surpasses human understanding to fill their minds. Lord, comfort this person wherever they are hurting. I just pray that you would give them faith, Lord God. Pray that you would help them to walk by faith and not by sight. Let them not look at what is happening all around them and be convinced that that is the outcome. Lord, but let them walk in faith. You are already working things out in our favor god but i pray against every single demonic attack that has been coming their way lord i pray that in the middle of the suffering that you would just comfort us that you would just be with us that you would guide us out of the storms that you would hold our hands lord the bible says that you go before us so lord make the path straight for us god lord we rebuke every single demonic lie that the enemy has tried to place inside of this person's mind we rebuke the thoughts of fear the the thoughts of depression, the thoughts of anxiety, the thoughts of worry or doubts. Lord, remove anything that is not sent from you, God. Any unholy or ungodly thoughts that are inside of our minds, we rebuke it and we bind them to the pits of hell. We take every thought captive and we make them obedient to Christ. We rebuke every single addiction, every single idol, God. Break the chains of demonic spirits off of us in the name of Jesus. I cover this person in the blood of Jesus. God, I pray for your Psalms 91 protection to fill this person, God. Cover them with your hedge of protection, my God. I pray that you would just break every single demonic spirit that has been operating through them or around them, God. Set this person apart as holy for your glory, God. Let this person's life be a testimony of your goodness, God. God, I pray that right now that you would strengthen them, that you would give them the strength to keep on going and to resist the resistance, to resist the attack of the enemy. God, let us not come into agreement with the lies that the enemy has placed in our minds. God, let us stand firm in your promises, in your truth, in your word. God, we pray that you would armor us up with the word of God, Lord God. I pray that you would bring joy into this person's life. I pray that you would fill them with the peace that surpasses human understanding. God, I pray that you would give this person a discernment to know what you are speaking to them in this hour. Help us to be in alignment with your will, God. We want your will for our life, not our own, God. Help us to surrender control of our lives. Help us to trust in the plans that you have for us. Help us to trust in you when we don't understand what's happening. Help us to not be shaken by the world, by the enemy, by the things all around us. Lord, help us to stand firm and stay rooted in you, Jesus. Lord, let us be so firmly founded in you, Jesus, that we do not move, that we are not moved by the things of this world. Lord, let us not be conformed to the patterns of this world, but let us be transformed by the renewings of our mind, God. We renounce any demonic soul ties, any demonic bondage commitment or agreement that we've come into agreement with, Lord God, from the enemy. Anything that we've come into agreement with, any strongholds, any idols, any soul ties, Lord, we break them right now in the name of Jesus. We repent for any knowing or unknowing sins that we've committed, God. Wash us clean, make us new creations. God, let us walk in our new identities in you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for your continuous grace over our lives. And in the mighty, holy, and precious name we pray. Amen.